Day by day, buildings are growing bigger and taller. And many countries have many tallest buildings. But when we talking about the cathedral, talking about the beginning to build the tallest cathedral. Many people don't know when began to build the tallest cathedral? If you don't know, then let's get to know it. Hello viewers welcome to MFTV's new video. Today in this video we are going to find out the beginning to build the tallest cathedral in past and how much time they hold the record as the tallest cathedral in the world before the 20th century. So let's begin to watch. History says that the first tallest cathedral the Pantheon in Rome, finished in the early 2nd century AD were made in around 126 AD, has a height from floor to top of 43.45 meters, which exactly corresponds to the diameter of its interior space. This building holds its record around 311 years. The Hagia Sophia, built in 537 AD in Constantinople, reaches a height of 55 meters. Built by the Eastern Roman Emperor Justinian I as the Christian Cathedral of Constantinople for the State Church of the Roman Empire between 532 and 537. With the height of 55 meters it holds its record till 1106, around 569 years long. South of Frankfurt, there is the largest Romanesque church called Spire Cathedral. The eastern spires of the Romanesque Spire Cathedral, completed in 1106. Spire Cathedral reaches a height of 71.3 meters. It was one of the largest buildings of its time and holds its record as the tallest cathedral till the year 1300, around 194 years. Old St. Paul's Cathedral was the cathedral that, until 1666, stood on the site of the present St. Paul's Cathedral. The cathedral was completed in 1314. Although the additions had been consecrated in 1300, the cathedral had one of Europe's tallest church spires, the height of which is traditionally given as 149 meters, surpassing all but Lincoln Cathedral. It holds a record of just 11 years. Beginning of the earliest tallest structures of the world was the Egyptian pyramids, with the Great Pyramid of Giza, at an original height of 146.5 meters, being the tallest man-made structure in the world for over 3,800 years, until the construction of Lincoln Cathedral. It was consecrated in 1092. Between 1307 and 1311 the cathedral reportedly stood at almost 160 meters tall. The cathedral held the record for over 238 years until the spire collapsed during a fierce storm in 1548. From the 13th century until the 20th century, the world's tallest building was always a church or cathedral, the central spire of Lincoln Cathedral surpassed Old St. Paul's in the early 14th century. The Lincoln Cathedral's spire collapsed in 1549, beginning a long interval where the status of the world's tallest building was borne by shorter buildings. Mary's Church in Stralsund became the world's tallest building after the collapse of Lincoln Cathedral's spire. The 153 meters of the central tower of St. Pierre's Cathedral in Beauvais was tallest from 1569 until it collapsed in 1573, making Mary's the tallest once again. In 1647, the bell tower of St. Mary's burned down, making the shorter Strasbourg Cathedral the world's tallest building. It was not until the completion of the Ulminster Cathedral in 1890 that the world's tallest cathedral was again also the tallest building ever constructed. 
surpassing the original configuration of Lincoln Cathedral with a steeple height measuring 161.5 meters. So viewers, hope your brain gets some information and knowledge. If you like this video share it with your friends that they also improve their knowledge. In the path with MFTV official, you are going to find out new knowledge, new information, new invention, new technology. Everything is going to find out in one circle. If you want to know something new, subscribe to stay with us for a new video on MFTV. Hope you all enjoyed this video. We ending hereby inviting you to watch new videos. Till then bye bye.